and welcome to Veritas Education's channel. My name is Liz, and I would like to take a few minutes today to talk about the application process for the Thomas Jefferson High School of Science and Technology, because many of our parents are interested in it. To apply to TJ, students need to meet several prerequisites. First, you must live within a participating school division. These include Arlington County, Fairfax County, Falls Church City, Loudoun County, and Prince William County. Second, there are academic requirements. You must have completed a full year course of Algebra One. You could also currently be enrolled in Honors Algebra One. You also need to be enrolled in Honors Social Studies or Honors English Language Arts. If Honors Level courses are not available at your school, you need to be in the highest level possible. Finally, you need to have a 3.5 unweighted GPA at the end of seventh grade. You will fill out this information on your application, which will be confirmed by your school counselor. The test this year will be on Saturday, January 29th, 2022. It will measure how well you fit the portrait of a graduate skills based on your responses to the essay questions. The test will have five essay questions. Four of them will be student-centered questions, and you will have 15 minutes per question. The fifth question will be a problem-solving science or math question, and you will have 30 minutes to complete it. In this test, you will want to write about experiences that demonstrate these skills. Communicator, collaborator, ethical and global citizen, creative and critical thinker, and goal-directed and resilient individual. There are three additional 21st century skills that TJ is looking for. Innovator, leader, and problem solver. The students who showcase these skills the best in their essays will pass the test. Once the test is over, it is up to the reviewers to send out invitations to join the illustrious TJ student body. These invitations will go out according to the new seat allocation system. Every public school in the participating school division has dedicated seats equal to 1.5% of their eighth grade population. So if your school has 150 eighth graders, then they have been allocated two seats. The top two qualifying scorers will be granted admission. If there are no qualifying scorers, then those seats become unallocated and are given to others. 550 students will be admitted into this upcoming school year. Final notifications for those admitted will be released by April 29th. But waitlisted students will continue to receive notifications throughout the summer until 550 students have been confirmed. If you have any questions about the TJ test, feel free to check out our website or contact us. Best of luck to all of you in this upcoming season.